Hi, it's me, C, or Seth first, and welcome back to my custom achievement race, where I have a list of random custom achievements I've made that should be quick and fun to complete in Minecraft, and I'll try and get them done as quickly as possible. So let's see what today's achievement is going to be, and it is to have a full stack of wheat. Okay, so let's start our timer and jump right into this. I think our only real strategy here is to find a village because anytime I've tried to actually grow wheat in these challenges, it takes like several years, it feels like. It, it takes actually forever until I remember that skeletons exist and bone meal exists. So I think our only real course of action is going to be to find a village, hope they have hay bales and make a sack of wheat that way. But to do that, we need a couple of basic requirements, uh, like wood and stuff, just so that we can travel. We also probably want to get a little bit of food because this running is going to get tiring. So I think I'll make some basic tools right now. Okay, Axe and a pickaxe, because I like axe for my combat. And of course, pickaxes are good for if we want to get wood, ever. Okay. Okay, I think we'll grab some cows for food. And I think we want to try run in one direction and not change too quickly, or else we might end up like re going in a direction we've already been in. I'm just grabbing some sheep in case I want to make beds. need one more that's quite unfortunate okay let's keep going somewhere there has to be a village I believe I think it shouldn't be too difficult to find a, a village but you know I might as well have cursed myself by saying that there we go okay we should have enough food in a little bit once we you know cook it Let's, if we get on this mountain, maybe we can see something in any one of the other directions. I don't know if going into that forest is the best move in finding a village. Okay. Let's see if there's anything, you know, that we can see. I think the most difficult part of this challenge will be to find that village that has all the hay bales because after that it's quite simple really if you think about it okay i don't know why i'm grabbing all these animals it's just i don't want to run out of food and if they're taking up an inventory slot i might as well it's just a sand bank I feel like we'll have more luck finding a village on a plains biome than in the forest. But I feel like that's just my personal opinion. Let's carefully make our way down. Let's quickly grab a little bit of stone so we can at the very least make a furnace and a couple tools if we need it and then we can get on our way to just finding a village oh my chat is very minimized right now i apologize for that okay my chat should be back to normal now we have 10 let's grab a little bit more while we're here let's grab some coal just so that i can at least make a torch and enough to cook some food be fine I think we'll leave it at that and let's go across it to this other plains biome and see if we can find us a village I think this is the most prepared we've ever been at the start of a challenge we've got food we've got materials to make a bed and we have I mean the basic necessities for survival oh she had a saddle so we could grab this horse but we do not okay. 
I believe we'll find a village right around one of these corners. This is annoying. I don't want to go down into that. Okay. We can make our way around. Now, should there be a strategy for finding villages? I think kind of just going in one direction is pretty good. Because then at least you're not going to be going in a direction you've already been in accidentally. I guess that really is my only strategy. Maybe getting the high ground as often as possible so you can just see around you. So I can't see any, which is unfortunate. Ooh, we're hungry. It's about five minutes in, so night isn't falling quite yet. Let's get to the top of this. Let's make a quick furnace. And we'll put this in there with this. And we'll make at least one torch. And go my offhand. And we'll make a bed. I probably should have uh, actually made that bed and, you know, clicked on it. There we are. Okay, then let's grab our food while it's cooking. I see a village. Change of plans. Um, we're running. Wait, actually, let's grab one more piece of food. We found a village. Nothing else matters. I'm sure the village will have some food for us. Now, if this isn't a um, haystack village, a bale, not haystack. Hey Bale Village, then we are kind of in trouble because we left our food back there. But we can get, get more food, I'm not too worried. Now we've also lost sight of the village, oh there it is. But see, that's why I said take the high ground and hopefully you'll be able to, able to see further. And you'll just see a village right in the distance. Of course you could also change your render distance, um, that would have also helped, but you know. I got there in the end. Okay. Do I see any hay? Do I see any hay? I do. I see hay. We're good. I was worried this was gonna take forever, but I think we got quite lucky with finding these hay bales. Okay, so one of these has nine. We need 64. That's just under seven. Yeah, okay. Well, over. No, yeah, over seven. There we go. We have a whole stack, so let me pause this timer. In under eight minutes, we've got a whole stack of wheat. All thanks to these hay bales. I think I did quite well. Um, I made a plan for long term, all the way in the back, by the way, there. That's where we, uh, ooh, our furnace is right up there. Just about to see it. Um, but I made a plan for long term. And then I ended up not needing it because I got things done short term, which I'm quite happy with. This didn't take super long, as I thought it would, because I've had a lot of trouble growing wheat in past challenges, so I'm happy I went with a different route this time. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed. If you have any ideas for other challenges sim similar to this one that you want me to add onto my list, and maybe it'll get picked one day, definitely let me know in the comments below. If you attempt this, or any of my other challenges, how did you do? What was your time compared to mine? Do you have any better strategies? All of that. But yeah, hope you're doing good. Hope you have or had a good day. But that's the end of this challenge, this video. So I guess I'll see you in the next one. And until then, keep smiling. Bye!